Hola! Buenos dias, Laura Grove. Today is May the 5th. Cinco de Mayo. And before we get into any of the festivities today, we're going to get started. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right. I saw the weather this morning and it looks like it's rainy and hot. Rainy and hot feels like at least we should be in Florida, but I guess not. So rainy, yuck. Hot, uh, if it was sunny, I'd be okay with that. But anyway, I do have a special announcement to make. I knew before everyone else, and I'm so excited about it. I could barely keep it to myself. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We need to congratulate Ms. Mouse is the winner of The Masked Singer. That's right. Ms. Mouse, congratulations. Now, does anybody know who Ms. Mouse is? Shout it out, shout it out. Oh, I think at least three of you have it right. At least three. It is Ms. Burroughs. How awesome is that? Congratulations, Mrs. Burroughs. We are so proud of you. You have won our utmost respect and love. Yay! Now, you deserve us. Going bananas. I'm so happy to see you, but this is the wrong segment. This isn't where you're supposed to be right now. Oh my goodness. Okay. So here we go. We have one school, one book. Hopefully, you got to read it. We've got chapters 22. 23, 24 last night, and things were going crazy. They were unraveling. Oh my goodness. Juanita, she hit that button on Charles' special phone. Oh, then they got their real powers. Benny got super speed after Rafter got super strength. What? Yeah, I know. It's bananas. Oh, <laughs> here we are. Bananas. Um, yeah. And Juanita can shoot flames out her hands? Crazy. Now, they get together. The three of them defeated Charles. Then a helicopter appeared and October Jones... October Jones got out of it? Okay. It turns out he's the head of the real superhero family that's been tricking the Baileys and Johnsons all along. Double cross. And there's more. He's a super, super villain. I know. This is just bananas. <laughs> so. This. Now, let's see. Tonight, you're going to be reading 25 and 26. So check, excuse me, check out the school flip grid to answer the trivia questions. Also, submit any questions you might want to ask the author, Marion Jensen, on School Flipgrid 2. Um, happy reading. And you just got to check back tomorrow, see what happens. We're almost to the end of the book. Crazy. So, as I said before, it's Cinco de Mayo. And it is a beautiful celebration of Mexican heritage. It's celebrated with parades and rallies, and um, most of the time it's accompanied with mariachi bands and traditional dances and lots of food. And sometimes um, they have traditional Mexican meals, like with tacos and tamales, and sometimes like the stuff that we have here is like fajitas and burritos and things like that, but um, just amazing things. Just amazing things. And I have some pictures. These are decorations that you could see sometimes in, in Mexico. You'd have uh, 
This is the dancing. These are dancers in their traditional dress. And then I have mariachi men here. They're playing their guitars, their trumpets, and then happy Cinco de Mayo up here. And I have all sorts of stuff. All the food is here, the chilies and the tacos, all sorts of things. But the music is something we definitely need. We definitely need to, to experience. And the music is folk songs. Folk songs are something that uh, are played throughout the celebration. And I have one that happens to be in our orchestra book. The one that everybody plays in fourth and fifth grade. Um, and this is called, and this one's a tough one to say, it's number 18 in the book, but it is Firolira Lera. Here we go. I'm going to play it one more time and this time I want you to do a little jiggle and I want you to clap anytime you feel like it. You can clap or snap or make some kind of fun noise. One more time. Two, three, one. for today. Hopefully you have plenty of celebration left of all throughout the day with your teachers and your friends. Now, one last thing. Remember today that uh, next week we have our big celebration, our safari, our instrument safari that's coming up on May 15th. You have flyers for third and fourth grade to pick instruments. So if you can, don't forget Hopefully I'll see you there. Have a wonderful Cinco de Mayo. I'll see you later. We have one more thing, the pledge. So, all right, lions, let's go. Lions, inspire others to roar because we are ready to learn, have opportunities to grow, accept everyone, and Respect ourselves and others because here at Lorewood, we are roaring with pride and potential. Have a great day. Bye.